This is Evan Strong, and I'm a U.S. Paralympic snowboard athlete, and this will be my first Paralympic Games. Growing up in Maui, Hawaii, of course, grew up surfing. My mom gave me my first skateboard when I was five. It was a very natural transition going into snowboarding. I used to get around I, on a motorcycle, and one day coming home from work, uh, a woman coming in the opposite direction, uh, she was driving an SUV and veered into my lane, hit me head on um, at 65 miles per hour. I was thrown 100 feet from my bike and it happened so quickly. And uh, my left leg was laid up over my chest, my uh, left foot was on my right shoulder. And as soon as I saw that, I put my head back on the ground and just started to say to myself, I'm not okay, I'm not okay, I'm not okay. And like the first real thought that I had was like, shirt on today. I'm never gonna skateboard again. My left leg was amputated three days later. <laughs> That's not <laughs> a bad shirt. Sure I actually turned 18 in the hospital um, and it was about a week after my amputation and all my friends and family were there and I told them on my birthday I'm gonna skateboard again. This is my goal. I don't know what it's gonna look like. I don't know how long it's gonna take. I don't even know how a prosthetic works. That's my goal. And uh, it was a long road to recovery. Around that two year mark, I started to roll around on my skateboard again. And as soon as I could do that, I got a job at the local skate park and it's kind of created this momentum. And it now has translated over into snowboarding and just one small goal after another small goal. Now I'm gonna be representing our country in Sochi, Russia, step by step, goal by goal. From being in the intensive care unit on life support, now being one of the most premier snowboarders in the world.